please help me give a very, very warm welcome to Lerato Nyokong, who is a process engineer at Sasol. Hey, everybody. Wow, no. That's not the energy I gave you. Hi, everybody. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. So, my name is Lerato. I'm a process engineer at Cecil. Can you see the hard hat? What does a process engineer do? Hey. What's a process? I'm gonna ask your teacher. Huh? They don't know what a process is. <laughs> does anyone know what a process engineer does? Or what I studied, at least, to become a process engineer? No one? Okay, so I'm here to educate you. No way, I didn't study industrial. Chemical engineering. I did chemical engineering, guys. So I'm a process engineer. So what I do is we take raw material and we process it. That's where the process comes from. And we make it into valuable products. What does Sasol do? What, what products do we do? What products do we do? Guys, there's a soul, Sasol village that you just went to. What do we do? Oh, there, there. We've got somebody there who knows what Sas someone here knows what Sasol does. You do petrol. We do petrol. <laughs> we do petrol, guys. What else do we do? Oh, there's two hands that side. They also know what we do. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> There's a lot of hands now. <laughs> Gases. Gases. Coals. Coal. We do coal. Wait, I'll answer that. <laughs> Let me first <laughs> get... Thank you for that. Diesel. Diesel. Petroleum jelly. Petroleum jelly. Oil. Oil. Wow, okay, interesting. Yeah, no, you're right. We do this. Got you. <laughs> One more. Candles. Candles. Oh. Wait, wait, okay. Thank you. Okay, let me answer. So we don't do candles, but we do wax that they use for candles. So Sasol has a whole lot of products. We've got petrol, we've got diesel, we've got waxes, we've got chemical. Hey, we're busy. We're busy, guys. Right? So there's two types of, Sasso has two types of process engineers. We've got your plant process engineer, and then we've got your process design engineer. So I've worked for both. I've worked as a plant engineer, and I've worked for, a, right now I'm a process design engineer. So what we do in design, they give us an idea and like, okay, we want you to produce 500 liters of petrol. Come up with a process. Now I have to sit down and think, okay, I need palms, I need this, and I need that, and I, I need to do a whole structure that you see outside here on the Sasolpec site. So that's what I do as a design engineer. The plant engineer, they maintain that site. So they work on the actual plant. They are the ones who make sure that daily we are on spec, you get the right petrol, the waxes, our customers get what they need, right? But now we're going into a sustainable future. He said, we, okay, we don't produce coal, but we do use coal to make petrol. But now we've got greenhouse gases. Somebody said acid rain, and I was like, oh my gosh, greenhouse gases. But Sasol has an initiative, by 2050, we need to be zero net DHG. 2050, guess who will be there? I won't be there. You'll be there. You guys will be working to make sure that there's no greenhouse gases. So that innovation is on your side. Can somebody tell me what kind of feedstock we need 
to make sure that we have net zero. My metrics. Metrics, ne? High school. You guys. High school. Great. Oh, grade 11. Oh, my grade 11. Science. Greenhouse, come on. Give me. <laughs> she goes, ma'am, answer, ma'am. Ma'am, you have to answer. We don't know. <laughs> she says her mom is throwing her under the bus. Oh my gosh, wow. Somebody's getting detention. <laughs> okay, so nobody knows. No one knows. Greenhouse. Green. Okay, what do I mean by green? Let's start there. What do I mean by green? Plants. Yes, nice one, plants. So we're using something that would not give off carbon. Carbon dioxide. Because that's what's messing us up right now, right? Carbon, em carbon dioxide emissions. That's what we're trying to reduce. So as such, so we're trying to reduce our carbon dioxide emissions. So we need a feedstock that does not have carbon dioxide. So we need to use some, anybody? Plants, yeah, no, plants, biomass, basically, right? You guys know, shame the, I don't know if the primary guys know bi biomass. Do you guys know? No, you don't. Okay, you'll learn about it, don't worry. <laughs> I'm not teaching you now what biomass is. But what I'm saying is, guys, you are the future that's going to be standing here where I am right now and telling the others that we did zero emissions. We are sold at 2050 with zero emissions. Right? Is anybody want to be an engineer here? Yeah. Wow, I love it. How many of you? Give me your hands. Oh, lovely. My grade 11s. Grade 11s. Only one of you. Only one. Well, Two of you are like, oh, nice, I love it. Which engineering do you want to guys do? Civil. Oh, nice. Yay. Mechanical. No chemical. I haven't convinced anyone that they want. You want to? Which one do you want to be? The process engineer does. Didn't I answer that? I didn't answer. I didn't yeah. answer what a process is. They transform raw material into valuable everyday product. Yes, that's what <laughs> <laughs> I wanna be mechanical. I wanna be chemical engineering. Yes, girl, where are you? I can't see you. Where are you? Yeah, I've got one. I'm convinced. Yes, I've done my job. She'll be taking my job. <laughs> She'll be the one taking my job. So guys, uh, on a serious note, Sasol is doing a lot of work to do this. Um, also part of Sasol Foundation. Who knows Sasol Foundation? Craig Levens, do you know Sasol Foundation? You don't know Sasol Foundation? I'm sad, guys. The reason why you're at TechnoX is because of Sasol Foundation. <laughs> <laughs> wow, okay. Anyway, there's the Sasso Foundation bursary. So Sasso's got two bursaries, right? The Sasso Corporate, the one that closed, and now we have the Sasso Foundation bursary. Ma'am, please tell your grade 12s. It's closing on Monday. <laughs> yes, it's closing on Monday on the 21st. I'm surprised you don't know. But I'm telling them now, platoon, guys. Okay, I'm telling you now. You have today's Thursday. Monday is closing. Get your applications in, guys. Yes. So Sasol Foundation comes into the community and does what we're doing now, letting you guys know that we are around. We are here to help you. Right? I also work with another foundation. It's called Hudisanang Youth Empowering Foundation. 
work in the rural areas, we take um, information about bursaries, about careers, about any, so in the rural areas mostly that we work, children are not exposed to what we have here. So I go there and I tell them that we've got careers in STEMI. We've got careers you can apply. I help them apply for higher education. And also to tell them about Sasol Foundation. I'm shocked you guys don't know, but okay. <laughs> That's my story, guys. Any questions? I think my time is up. It was up a long time ago, but... <laughs> oh, question. Ma'am, um, um, can, um, can you please tell us how you ensure that uh, there is zero emission for, for Sasol? How, how do you ensure that? Okay, so we are working towards getting to zero emission. But it's all about feedstock. What are we feeding into? We're trying to phase ourselves out of coal and natural gas and going into more sustainable um, feedstocks. Yeah, trying to go green. Yay, that's it. Hi. Hello. Hi, hi. I want to ask, which school do we need to apply? To do? to do chemical engineering. Oh, okay, so, oh, I didn't say, oh, I did mine at VETS. So I went to VETS University, but you can go to any university. UCT has it, Stellenbosch, uh, Pretoria. Actually, chemical engineering is everywhere, guys. If you want to do, if you want to be an engineer, you'll go to the universities. And then we've got what we call in Sassel technologists that we will do at a university of technology. And then we've got artisans that you go to a TVET college, but chemical engineering is in all of them. Oh, okay, Mo yo, time was up, guys. Greeting everyone, ma'am. Hi, Thank hi, you so hi. much for giving me this chance. Oh, I wanna ask how to do gas. How do you do gas? What a broad question. How do we do gas? <laughs> Which gas? Gas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you mean LPG? Oh, I have no idea. That's a different line of work that I do. I don't know how to do LPG. <laughs> yes. Oh, you have an, this, there's another one here. My grade 11s here who don't know biomass are here. Mm. <laughs> Yeah. To make petrol, right? Yes, we use But coal. isn't the coal what the car needs? Doesn't that mean you have to change the car as well? Like the design of the car? Yes. So we are, you, we are working with... So we are not... In industry, we don't work isolated. So when we're saying we need to go into green, high, green technology, the cars are also moving into... I mean, you know, they're going into electrical. Now we've got electrical cars. What's the point of? Making petrol. For now, because we've got cars that use petrol. <laughs> but no, I, don't think <laughs> I understand what you're, yeah. you're getting at. I know what you're getting at. That's why we as Sassel are trying to move towards uh, getting green, greener petrol. For greener cars? Yes. Oh, so the cars are also moving. So the cars are not, the, the car manufacturers are not also just doing cars. They're also moving towards green technology. That's why I'm saying we don't, we don't work as an isolated industry. Everybody works together. Yeah. So what will be the point, what will be the point of Cecil then if we're going to have electrical cars? Why, would you guys still produce Oh, do you petrol? know Cecil? We also make our own electricity. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, we, <laughs> we have <laughs> steam stations <laughs> that make, uh, we and ESCOM, we talk to each other. Okay. We, <laughs> yeah, no, we do. Yeah, we do everything at Sasol. I think somebody needs to come next after me. So many questions. One last question. Eh? Where's the mic? Okay, my name is Bali. Oh, Hi, sorry Bali. for my bad manners. Hello. Hi. 
Uh, I want to ask, how do you guys make petrol, since you guys make petrol? Because literally it's oil. Where does oil come from? How do you make petrol? It's a, so it's a process. So that's all has, if you, I need you to go and read up on that one. Because that's a whole process. Of, it's called Fisher Trough, the Fisher Trough process. It's specifically to Cecil. Please go and read up on it. Fisher Trough. <laughs> That will tell you how we make petrol. It's a long process. I can't explain it now. Okay. Thank you so much, everybody. So we're going to apply for the Sasso Foundation bursary, right? Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Thank you.